Hello, Raptor lovers. Before we start, we want to say thank you to over 200 subscribers and over 6,000 viewers. Maybe do me a favor, press the subscribe button so you won't miss a video. And now, let's get started. Hello, Raptor lovers, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sven, this is Woody, and here's my son, Even. Hello. And today we are going to build the ventilation system. But if you can see here, uh, to get all those big holes and drills into my new enclosure, I got a new sponsor. It's a company called Word. If you, if you don't know it, I put a link down in the description. And they sent me a lot of stuff to get this build done. They sent me nice drills they sent me a whole source just to get this job really good done and they sent me like this foam pistol i got foam i got foam cleaner uh, so i think with all these nice tools uh, i will get this job really good done because if you remember one of my last videos i uh, have a little spoiler here You see what happened if you don't use the right tools. This was a, the wrong tool, this was a wrong drill, it wasn't sharp enough. So, and maybe the company word said, man, this guy needs good tools. So, I put a link down in the description, check it out. You can buy everything you want there, everything you need for your projects. So, let's start to build some ventilation stuff. Okay, what is the plan for today? Today I want to build in those ventilations, when ventilation systems. This is computer stuff, 12 volts. I have a few of them and I want to build in my enclosure. So when I, I take maybe this pipe, I use pipes uh, for this. And what is my plan here? If you watched my previous videos, you will know that on top there is a big cable box. And in this cable boxes, there are all those ballasts for the lightning. So it's nice and toasty in there. And I want to use those heat to put it back into my enclosure. So the first step will be drill a nice hole with my new hole saw into the top, put this pipe through here, put a ventilator on top of here, and so the ventilator will suck the warm air out of my uh, cable box and put it inside this enclosure. So this is recycling the heat. Then the next step over here, I had just started to, to fix this, it's just glued on this pipe. So the next step is, I will put this one on top of my mangrove tree. And here is a little spoiler, because I, I didn't get to, to cover all the stuff. This is the first layer, here is nothing on it, but look at this, a little spoiler. This is this cork bark. Look at the structure of the cork bark and look at the structure of my mangrove tree. And if I get this covered in this color, man, this will be so amazing. There will be, this is like a root and there will be a branch over here. Okay, uh, spoiler alert, finished. Okay, this will be the next ventilator. This ventilator will suck the warm air from all the heat lamps and push it behind those mangrove tree down. Oh, can you see there is a outlet and the warm air will blow out over the substrate. And you can't see it right now. Over here, if you watched my videos, there is the entrance of the cave. And 
uh, on the edge of the cave there are ventilation uh, openings so the the air could flow through here and if you know if you have those sliding glasses there's al always a gap between both both uh, glasses so I have a big sliding door here and a big sliding door on the other side and this will also get a nice uh, nice airstream through my terrarium. I have to watch a little bit for the heat and for the humidity but I have a lot of time to check everything to maybe if I have to change something, maybe I have to put another ventilator in or another heat lamp. I will see this. I have a long time to play with it until it's perfect. And if it's perfect, then it's time to get a new visitor to get a monitor lizard. Okay, enough of talking. Let's try to build in all the ventilation system. That's a mess. See, I had to drill through wood and to plastic from this from this cable box. Whoa! <laughs> what a mess. So let us have a look on top. Oh, kuckuck! Evie? Von unten? Uh, okay, kein problem. No problem. So, yeah, drill a hole with the right tools. It's so easy. Okay, let's have a look. See, here's this nice hole. This is my plastic pipe. I want to put this in here. Maybe it will go one-handed. Okay, fits perfect. Look at this. Down here, I have this pipe. Yes, and I will take, where is it? One of these small ventilators. I will glue this here on top. So, this will suck the warm air out of this cable box. And I don't waste the heat. So, let's start to glue the pieces together. Okay, now we start to glue the ventilators on this pipe. It's quick and easy. Just take some glue. I did it here before. Glue this onto the pipe. I use this glue gun. You can get this also at the company Word. I didn't have it, sadly, but it works. So, okay, let's glue this stuff on here. And this is how it looks like after I glued it. I have two pipes, two ventilators, and now I have to solder a few cables on here and then connect it on top and then we have a test if it works. Okay.
Good, I have all the components ready. I soldered every cable, every cable end. So I have the two ventilator pipes, I have my connector, a little timer, connectors here. So I think I hop on top the terrarium and then uh, I will put all the cables together and then check how it works. Okay. Okay, dokey. I connected everything. This is the ventilator on the left side. I have those electrician contacts down here. I will insulate this a little better. Also, I will clean up this mess. I have another connector here from the ventilator. I will use a, a timer, but right now, just for testing, this is the connector. I will put it in and let us see if it works. Oh, sounds good. Let us have a look. Okay, down here. Oh, there's a letter. Down here, I have the first ventilator. This is sucking the warm air from the top of the enclosure and blows behind those mangrove tree down there out of this pipe. This is blowing, you can see it, maybe the moving of the plants. It's blowing. And over this side. Woo! What did my son hear? Yes, don't forget to like and subscribe so you won't forget or you won't, won't miss another series of this build. See how it works. The fan is blowing the warm air from the top into the enclosure. This ventilator over there is sucking it down on the bottom and then I have a nice circulation inside here. The fresh air, like I told you, is coming from between those sliding doors on this one and on this side and down there from the cave. Okay, that, that's it for today. I hope you like it. If you like it, don't forget and we see us on the next build step. Bye bye!